Hey YouTube, so before we hop into the video, I just want to show you something you really unique and cute I got from Moly Susie. I got a nail brush storage bag. It's super, super cute. Perfect um, for nail supply brushes. And if you do makeup, I, be I believe this is good for makeup brushes as well. Um, it is like a pinky peach salmon color, really pretty sturdy zipper. And it does have all these compartments where I can put as many brushes as I want along with other nail supplies. They do have two pocket folds in the front and you can bend the folder back to stand up. So while you're working, your brushes are up front and up view. Here I'm putting some of my favorite art brushes because as you guys know, I have been into doing a lot of detail artwork or should I say I'm learning. So I started out putting my beetle brush um five piece kit in here because i do use it a lot and then two of my favorite brushes well it's actually the same brush from born pretty as you can see it's really small in detail i am able to do a lot of detail work with those brushes so i did add two of them here is a kit that i got from amazon this is the lafuna brushes so inside the kit are a few brushes that i absolutely love you guys see me do the rainbow look with it but i do use it on my clients i am now going in with yasir these are also from amazon um, brushes these are 10 brushes but you want to get five they're dual sided so you can fit 10 brushes in here with only using five compartments last but not least i am going in with a marquette um, flat brush and a metal side just in case i have to add any rhinestones to my design i can use that you can also put nail files, nail art, whatever you can stuff inside those pockets. This does retail for $69.99. Like I said, any discount codes or anything I have will be across the screen and also down in the description box. So as promised, this is part two of me swatching my wholesale acrylic powders I have. These powders, I have ordered a ton of them um, in bulk. I am waiting for them now. And these are by far my favorite. As you can see, the colors are unique. The powder blend beautifully. These are beginner friendly. If you are scared of acrylic, these are powders that you would definitely love. If you guys can see, I have no trouble picking up the product. It does the work for itself. Um, it's self-leveling. And then I'm able to maneuver the powder for a while. So if you're somebody who is scared of acrylic because when you pick your bead up, it's stiffen up on you and gets stuck on the nail, these powders do not do that at all. I did get like maybe 60 powders from this particular wholesaler here, but I believe I only show you guys about 20 because even though this video is sped up, it is really time consuming to do these swatches. Um, this is a beautiful like dark chocolate brown color, really pretty, blends beautifully as you can see. And it, I just think it's just gorgeous. I'm gonna get a lot of use out of that shade this fall and winter. And here I'm going in with like a greenish, uh, like a mint green, I would say, type of green. Really pretty. Colors like this for me um, are hard to find that I actually like. I have a few from Glam and Glitz that are okay, but they're a little grainy. But I found that powder and this one, this Tiffany blue one, to be gorgeous as well. These are two shades that I have been looking for. And I do have trouble finding shades with, that aren't grainy if that makes sense. If you have a color acrylic powders, you know what I mean. It's hard to find really good color powders and these powders are bomb. Now, a little backstory on these. Oh, this is another unique shade that was just like, this is just screaming extra cream in my coffee, please. This is so, so pretty and unique. Um, I will say too, any of the acrylic that I'm taking off at the bottom, I am able to take that acrylic and put it back on the top of the nail so that I'm not wasting it. You'll see that I show you guys I do that in one, on one of the nails. Um, yeah, these powders are bomb. And what's crazy is this is not, these powders are not from a wholesaler that sell acrylic powder. Um, it's one of my supplies that suppliers that I have been dealing with for a while, just buying nail art from. And I just so happened to be talking to them on a, um, video chat and i asked them about acrylic powder and she was so nice to find some for me and sent this to me and i'm just like in love so i will be getting these powders i believe these are the powders that when i do brand my acrylic powders that i will be putting on my site i ordered a shit ton of these so yeah i'm just looking for little cute packaging because you know packaging does matter especially if you are a collector like myself so here since i didn't go in with a lot of 
color acrylic in my last video i wanted to swatch a variety i know a lot of the colors that i used in the last video were nudes which can be a bit boring but here i just love these colors i wanted you guys to see how true to color they are in the jar a lot of times we get color acrylic powder and what you see in the jar is not really what you get um in person and these are just these are just bomb i'm just like i love these powders i have been using them on my clients um so yeah they work well they are self leveling if i didn't say that before they just blend like butter i know that sounds cheesy but you guys see it for yourself so here i did wanted to hop into a little bit of the glitter shades that i got just so you guys can see i like shades like this um, for people who constantly get bling nails this is cute to have a, as your base you can go in with a glitter acrylic or a polish totally up to you or personal preference but here i'm just showing you guys like i said i wanted to show you a variety i figured i would swatch all the colors first and then hop into glitter i do at some point go back into solid colors just to show you how the acrylic meltdown on the brush so here this is like a really chunky um purple color i believe this has some type of blue undertone in it uh, i don't know if you guys can see that on camera but here like i said really easy to blend just like all the powders the clear that i got from this um company is like glass it's beautiful i don't believe i show you guys in this video i might do a part three and show you the rest of the powders from this i do have a lot of powders um i don't want to just keep doing like part three and part four i mean if you guys want i don't mind showing all of them to you i did um only swatch about 15 or 20 just because even though this is sped up it is really time consuming um to do the swatches so um i didn't want to sit here and do 30 of them now these glitters are like i said some of them a little bit chunky so they do come off on the brush the way that you guys saw it's going there but once you put it on there and put your monomer it does also blend down beautifully this is like a black color silver glitter um with like a little ab reflection really pretty um i love these powders let me know down below what you guys think do you like this seller a lot more than the last i do the last video that i did i had like maybe two or three that i actually really like here i really like just about all of their powders i believe i, I total i might have got like i said 60 to 70 colors from this company and out of all of them i promise you only about five or six i wasn't too crazy about but they weren't bad so here is just a regular silver glitter acrylic with no reflection just silver really pretty for those of you that are looking for a glitter just like this without different color that reflect from it really really cute and then here this is another beautiful shade this is a pink glitter it has different variations of pink um, as you can see for yourself really pretty also blends down the same i know i keep saying it but these powders are just like bomb that's why um a lot of you didn't know this but this is why i gave away so many of my color acrylic powders because i don't feel the need like i first of all i don't have storage for all this stuff i'm have i have my husband building me shelves after shelves and i feel like i'm hoarding acrylic powder don't get it twisted i am a collector and i like to have different stuff but i got rid of all my not polish i got rid of just a, like a lot of different brands that i don't feel like i'm going to be collecting their stuff so it's no sense in me just hanging on to what i had and i did keep certain things from those companies that i actually do like so you will see certain powders where i only have like two or three but after i'm done with them then i'm just done because like i said i found these amazing powders and if i get them for myself then these would be the colored powders that i use some things like um valentino i believe i'm going to always use mia secrets i'm going to always use certain powders are just like my favorite and those are it this that gold shade was beautiful so here i do have glitter in my brush so i just wanted to show you guys how buttery it is i picked it up bam do y'all see how it just transitioned and that's how all of them change but i didn't take the time out to record that part in all of them because i didn't want the video long these are really buttery and beginner friendly i can't say that enough so beautiful this shade here as you can see um i use it a lot if you look in a jar you can see that it is a little wore down because i use this a lot a lot of my clients get this shade um yeah really pretty like mauvey 
color also perfect for fall and yeah that's what it looks like i believe i got one more yeah and here i put in one of the pink shades this pink shade is gorgeous too i'll definitely make sure i have this shade um again blends beautifully as you guys can see if you're scared of the one bead method you do not have to be scared of the one bead method with this here acrylic because it is self-leveling it's going to do the work for you you just got to make sure you're guiding it with your brush and then the rest is just that so again um if you watch this video to the end thank you don't forget to like because other people find my channel don't forget to subscribe and yeah this is the overall look of them i will check you guys out in my next video thanks for watching bye